Hi, I'm Rachel King, Director of Marketing and Communications at the Jewish Women's Archive. On September 16, 1988, one of my all-time favorite movies was released. Crossing Delancey was directed by Joan Mickland Silver and tells the story of Izzy, a young single woman in New York who's caught between two lives the literary uptown life where she, where she lives and works, and the Lower East Side, where her bubby lives, and where she visits by crossing Delancey Street. The tension between these two worlds is uh, embodied in two potential suitors for Izzy, the main character. Uh, one suitor is this dashing European author who uh, sweeps her off her feet and the other suitor uh, is um, she, Izzy is set up with through uh, a yenta that Bubby hires. He's Sam the Pickle Man, and Izzy is initially uh, turned off by his downscale life um, and is uh, enraptured by the, the heady intellectual life that the author potentially offers her. Uh, the movie really resonated for me when it was released. At the time, I was a young single woman in New York, and I was also pursuing a literary graduate degree. Uh, when I watched the movie, it um, really reflected my growing sense that one could find true poetry, um, true love, true meaning in the more prosaic parts of life if one looked hard enough. And that sometimes the heady, glittery, literary life um, might be a little bit misleading. In the end, Izzy ends up with Sam the Pickle Man, who's a wonderful mensch. And um, I took away the message that um, one should look past appearances um, and find true meaning. Crossing Delancey is a great movie and I can't recommend it enough.